the presence of family history is something to consider very uh, strongly. Uh, when there is a positive family history, uh, the likelihood that the teen suffers from a treatable uh, major depressive disorder is much higher than in someone who does not have that family history. Uh, again, some studies suggest that between 20 to 50 percent of teens who suffer from depression have a positive family history. So it's important for a caregiver, a treater, a parent to always check to see if there's a, someone in the family who may have suffered from depression, who may have been treated for depression. Uh, it may be that uh, uh, there, there was an uncle who uh, no one talks about. He's, in the, uh, he's one of the skeletons in the closet for a particular family. But it turns out that that uncle died mysteriously uh, so many years ago, was an alcoholic, and uh, no one knows what really happened to him. That, in res retrospect, could be an evidence of suicide in someone who was profoundly depressed and who was not treated within that family. So if they have a teen teenager who becomes depressed, it's something to keep in mind and to uh, be aggressive about treating that teen.